I think we've obviously, you know, we've had a consistent group of players uh, the last several years, uh, Macy Williams, Rachel McLemore, Destiny Perkins. Um, but with that, we've been able to add some key pieces along the way. And I, I think we just, you know, we, we've continued to, to get better, you know, each and every year. And uh, again, you know, last year was kind of a, a strange year for everybody, but, um, you know, we just want to keep getting better as a program. Well, I think depth, um, you know, as, as long as we continue to stay healthy, we've got a lot of depth to, to our roster. Um, we've got some veterans that, that really know how to play um, and, and we can shoot the basketball. Um, offensively, I think we've got a lot of weapons and now it's more about getting kind of the new players, um, you know, intertwined with our, our returning players uh, in a way that, that they can understand how we're going to defend and, and the techniques and whatnot. Yeah, I mean, I, I think she, my expectations for her just keep getting better. Um, you know, I know for her, she was excited to have kind of an off season um, that she didn't have last year. But, um, you know, I think from her standpoint, she's a tough matchup because she's very good one-on-one -on, -one on the blocks. She's continued to improve her outside shot, but probably her most underrated skill is her passing ability. Uh, she's a very, very good passer. And so, uh, she does all those things pretty well. She's pretty smart, knows how to stay out of foul trouble. Um, and obviously we're thrilled that you know, she's back for another year. We have two transfers, um, Madison Wise, um, who's a local kid, but, but played four years at Iowa State. And uh, she just brings, I mean, she's been to the NCAA tournament, comes from a top-notch program, um, knows how to play, very, very good shooter from the outside, and uh, gives us a little bit something different at, at that position um, different look than what we've had in the past. And then we have Rachel Kemp, um, who is, is uh, from Illinois, uh, transferred uh, this past year, was one of the best shooters in all of college basketball last year. I mean, she was top 20 in three-point uh, shooting, uh, averaged double figures, and uh, just a very versatile player, uh, big guard that can shoot it. Um, you know, I, I think adding those two to the pieces that we already have, I mean, you know, I think Rachel McLemore, is maybe the most underrated guard um, in the league. Um, she's incredibly, you know, versatile on defense. She's a very, very difficult one-on-one -on -one matchup. So that depth alone with the returners that we have, uh, if healthy, I, I think should should be fun to, to see what we can put on the floor. Um, we, for the team, we've really set like high goals. We obviously um, would like to win the Horizon League. We know there's a lot of tough teams, so that's not gonna be an easy task, so we're just trying to like get better every day and we have some new pieces. So we just want to figure out the best way to implement everyone and have great chemistry throughout the year. It really motivated us a lot, especially the year before making it and then knocking the reward of actually playing in it. And then coming up, like being right there, really just like left a like bad taste in our mouth. Like we really want to get back there and be able to actually play in the tournament this year. Um, for me, I've really been working on my mid-range game and just um, looking for like being ready to take the shots that are given to me, not hesitating. So, um, and then obviously just different ways to get people more involved and set up other people within our offense. Um, I feel like there's just any team can be any team on any day. Um, there's a lot of really good coaches in the league. So they scout really well, um, which definitely makes it challenging. They usually have everyone's strengths and, Weaknesses down to a T, so you definitely have to get creative on the offensive end.